These are true animals. When I say that, that means boats. When I say they are true animals, that means these are animals. They're not plants, they're not funguses, they're not protozoans. These are classified as animals. And we're going to talk in a second about why. Yes, Andrea? Um, my vision is ah. But you, if you just read it, I'll be okay. Okay. Yeah, there's really not a whole lot of writing. There's okay. true animals. Okay. Okay. So they are true animals. What, is, what makes an animal different from other kinds of organisms? It consumes. It consumes things. What do we call it when you're an organism that consumes things? Consumer. Heterotroph. Very good. They are consumers or heterotrophs. I'm not smart. I can't. Many shapes. There are many different shapes of sponges. I've given you three to look at. And I'm not going to hand this one around. You can come take a look at it later if you'd like. Uh, this one's kind of fragile. Yeah, it's a different kind of sponge. There are some sponges that are harder, almost like a rocky-like material. There are some of them that are small and teeny tiny little sponges. Some of them are branching, and of course, some of them are kind of fat and wide. So there's all different kinds, shapes of sponges. There are even sponges that are, well, I just said, little teeny tiny ones. I'm going to pass around some of these. Uh, this has actually got some cuttings and some small ones. So pass these around and take a look at some of the tiniest ones. Of course, you can't see them so well, so they have to be encased in that lucite. They come in many colors. We can see right up here, most of these kind of are brownish. If you were out looking at these in the ocean, there are reds, there are yellows, they're really bright, pretty looking colors. Uh, a lot of these are kind of 